If you are a man, you want to come here and defend your wife, I will bring evidence. You are a woman, you want to come here and defend yourself, defend your sister, your relative, I will bring evidence. I'm calling all of you out, all the Hausa married women in Abuja. <laughs> to my story, this woman came as a client, messaged me on Instagram that she wants to buy houses, this one. We decided to have a meeting. I went there. I went to the venue. I ordered my food. She has not yet come. When my food now came, that's when the woman now came. I was about to eat. She now said, ah, no, 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 no. Don't worry. We can have a better food upstairs. I was like, ah, but my food is already here. There's no need now. The woman, I don't know whether she, why she was in a hurry. She now gave me a check of one million. I said, ah, one million naira because I did not get If not, you don't go collect her. <laughs> so, are you not transcorp now? She was like, um, let's go to our executive lounge. I thought it was just one normal, you know, open space. So when we went there, apparently it's a room that she lodged. I was like, ah, this woman has money. For ordinary meeting again, to buy property, you, you, this is the kind of room you lodged. Very beautiful. House room, lounge, um, the dining area and everything. So we went to the lounge and sat down. This woman just removed scarf. She was like, hey, now I can order my food. I was not like, okay. I was about taking my order now, like from the, what was it called, from the phone. She now said, but don't order anything that has pepper, because she doesn't want pepper in her own mouth. I was, I was confused. that it's not your business. And besides me, I like pepper. But I was just like, okay, let me just order, um, what was it called, fries and chicken. So I ordered my own. She, she asked her personal assistant to bring two bullets. I don't drink, but I know that bullets is not joke. This woman jog one. Black bullets, my sister. She jog the second one. She see the campaign, she no shake. I say, ah, Alaja. <laughs> Alaja, don't be small hijab when she carry her. That one that used to wrap the whole body. She removed it. Jog one bullet, jog the second one. I said, okay, no problem. Me, she, I'm waiting for my food. I'm still trying to, you know, pitch in the reason why we're here. So as this woman was drinking, she was not even trying to talk to me. She was just making phone calls. You know when how men used to do when they're trying to impress a girl? When they're trying to show you, say, I get money. She was just talking about millions, the deals that she has, the money, this one, billion, 500 million, this one, that one, that one, that one. So my food now finally came. I was just about to eat. The woman said, hey, wait, she wants to show me something. She stood up from her chair, walked up to me. She has already zipped down already. Like after she removed her scarf, she already zipped down. So she was showing me some kind of useless pictures. And in the process of showing me those pictures, I'm confused. She has already, you know, removed her clothes. She was left with only bra. I was, I was not like, ah, ma, please, this is not the reason why I'm here. She started shouting. Threw the phone on my lap that I'm a hypocrite. That she sees my pictures on Instagram. She knows what I do. That I snap very sexy pictures and she knows that I'm into this kind of thing. This, 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 this. I was about to leave. She now knelt down, held my hand. She said, please, I should not leave. Now, okay, initially she wanted to give me 3 million plus the 1 million Lera check she already gave me downstairs. But now she'll make it 5 million. I said, please, I'm not still interested. Me, self, I started begging her, please, that now she'll give me 5 million Lera extra plus the 1 million Lera. And again, she will make sure her husband buys the land. I was like, ma, please, I'm still not interested. I was begging her to, because me, self, I want to run for my life. I was able to escape finally. I was not just seeing my friends that I see what happened to me. They're looking at me all like, see this moment. You know, no waiting. They happen for Abuja. That they, I would have done it now. That that's what they do too. If you're into this sugar baby business, leave sugar daddy. Oh, follow sugar mommy. The house I want. The one where they tie hijab. Very hypo, hypo, <laughs> very hypo critical. It's <laughs> a baby watch. But they pay very, very well. You better follow sugar mommies, especially the house ones. <laughs> the funny thing is that you see their husbands, they are all those women, you see them all in northern blocks, judging other people that and uh, this anger of your hair is out. So behind Allah, it's not good. This one, that one. But their wives are the ones that are the girls from 15 year old, 20 year old, married women. Imagine the lives of small girls. Why I'm moving here? Why do you think they even pay me pass? It's because this particular woman, they almost pay me. I saw her in one other blog. Insulting one girl that uh, her clothes is too tight. This one, that one. But meanwhile, you are 
with girls. With them paying them useless money. Me, I have evidence. So. And if people annoy me, if you trigger me, I will post faces, I will post chats, I will post the rotten pictures that they have sent to me. But my own now is, if I, am I the only one or are my friends the only ones that are experiencing this sugar mom meeting? Please, if you have your own experience, people DMing you, married women, sending you all manner of pictures. If you're an Abuja girl and you have experienced this kind of thing before, please share your story with us anonymously. And let's put hands together to fight these criminal acts. And the annoying thing is that these pictures, they are very ugly at sight. The angle is terrible, rotten, rotten, private, um, <laughs> what have you. If you're an Abuja girl and you have experienced this thing, Please share your story with us. Let us post it anonymously and put hands together to stop this rubbish. And if you are a hypocrite, stop this nonsense. Stop being a hypocrite. As a Hausa woman, please stop being. You can't be wearing hijab and be doing rubbish. Be doing nonsense. Please. Fantastic. <laughs> I've been hearing this gist about Abuja women and men. So you have the husbands the husbands who the top top ones they they are by <laughs> they have men they don't have they don't keep they are tired of keeping girls who side chicks no no they have side boys side cocks you know side you know you have hen and cock so they have side cock you have the wives now. They are into licky licky. <laughs> touchy touchy licky licky. Licking kuma. Like ice cream. <laughs> that is their own now. So the husband is carrying boys. Wife is doing guests. And all this while fasting, wearing hijab. It is the hypocrisy in Africa that is our major problem. <laughs> the hypocrisy. The things people do and hide under the guise of religion is so bad. So, so bad. My sister, they told you not to, they told you to come to room. You two, you carry your leg, you go. What do you think, say you, they go do inside room? They not told you not to eat pepper. The reason she told you not to eat pepper is so that when you are licking her kuma, Igbo, ahenfie, meat pie, shemba, onda kenu, porompo, omponam, when you are licking it like ice cream, like pepe will not go. You know if pepe enter your omponam, you are finished. <laughs> Especially if they use that yellow Cameroon pepper. Somebody eat food that have Cameroon pepper. Now give you licky licky. You are finished. <laughs> you, will, you will shout from now to tomorrow. So they say don't eat pepper. So that you will be ready to give her the licky licky very well. Your licky licky will enter. They want to give you 5 million. You rejected. You ran. See, let me tell you, most of your people that are into these sales of land and houses, how do you think they close the deal? How do you think? In fact, even boys now, they are giving up their own condo <laughs> for property sale. You will be in a company. One of my friends was in a company. They sell properties. A very large company. It's very popular. All the guests, they are meeting their targets. All him, he will go from, from office to office to office to office. He talk, tire. The men will say, okay, no problem. Yeah, don't worry, come back. We'll see you. You know, they sell. But once girl come, <laughs> it is later, one man now approached him, told him that, if I will buy from you, Ipip must enter your kundu. <laughs> My brother say that is the day he tendered his resignation from that job. <laughs> so you see, this baby girl lifestyle, baby boy lifestyle they live in Abuja. Many of them are into this thing. Many of them. 
In fact, many boys don't work there. This is their profession. Mboro na mboro. Ipipi na ipipi. This is their profession. Ipipi na kundu. It, it is their profession. It's a sad situation. Women are licking. Men are entering Nkundu. <laughs> husband and wife. Wife is doing their own. Husband is. Which person money that they take to all this nonsense? The money, the stolen money. They stolen from the people. The money, they stolen. Go and look at the lifestyle they live. Rich, affluently. Why the rest of the people, they are suffering. They don't thief money so much. They don't know what to do with it. They are enticing people to come and do like like. So what this girl said is true, but I won't say all. I will say ninety-five percent. That's almost all. Let's say ninety. Let me not be too. I didn't pluck that figure somewhere, but a lot, a lot of them are into this thing. A lot. It's like a pandemic now in Nigeria. We have laws. Now, people will ask me, oh, are there no laws against this in Nigeria? How can the people that do things, people that put the law, are the people that are flouting the law? You not expect them to enforce the law. <laughs> it's not possible now. It's not possible. And that's why many of the people you know, I will not mention anybody's name, can get away with many things. Many of the ABCD you know, they can get away with it comfortably because the law permits them. People that put the law are the ones that are carrying them. So how will they not get away with it? It is what it is. There is, there is no problem. This the, the beauty about life is that no matter how long you will die, all of us will die. And we'll go and answer for everything we do. It's not a problem. I don't have a problem with that. Live your life how you want to live it. But my problem with many ABCD in Nigeria, you want to be ABCD. Be ABCD. Why are you trying to convince somebody that is straight, convert them to ABCD? Because you know they need money. You be showering them gifts to convert them to ABCD. Go and meet ABCD. Do your leke leke, your touchy touchy, umbaro na unkondo, ipipi na unkondo, Everything na kuma. Sorry, kuma is nothing. Okay, kuma na kuma. Uh, yeah, kuma na kuma. Together. Do it with yourselves. Why are you trying to convert a straight person to being A, B, C, D? X, Y, Z. Why? Is it fair? Think about it now. Thank you. Hey, where are you going? It is smoky, bo. When you watch this video now, didn't you laugh? You laughed. But you still refuse to subscribe. Are you among my village people? <laughs> you are among my village people. You don't want me to make it in life. Continue. You refuse. You laughed. Shouldn't my reward be <laughs> click the subscribe button, click the notification bell, and click all notifications. And when you finish watching, you share. Share to your friends so that they too will laugh. So that me too, I will go far. But no, you decided to be among my village people you want to watch and go. <laughs> Don't be among my village people. They are not good people. I post videos every day, every single day, to make you laugh. If you join the tribe, the fantastic tribe, every day you will just be laughing. Look at this one now. This one is to watch all my funny videos playlist. This one is to watch my last video. And this one is to subscribe. 